Big day for Noah. What day is it? Race day. Well, it is the day after our big grand opening and I am here to pick out some things for whatnot. Are you playing Jenga? Did you get, you didn't get to play Jenga yesterday. You were too busy at that cash register, huh? Look at you with your snazzy little race shoes still on. It's leather. Are you wearing, are you wearing dino nuggets in your? Yes, I am. You're wearing little dinosaur chicken nuggets. All right, okay. Big day for Noah. What day is it? Race day. It's race day. We're at Speed Vegas. It's early. It's cold. This is called Mama Love. Let me get that. Let me get that door for you, Noah. Thank you. Let me get that door for you, Jordan. Thank you. Where are we going, Noah? Driver's briefing. What does that mean? It's before the race. It's the briefing. Oh. All right. Just finishing briefing, and now. It's uh, off to the track. Oh, it's cold out here, Noah. Yeah. It's very cold out here. They had rain last night. It's gonna be a slick track. You ready for a slick track? <laughs> well, this is going on over here. Well, uh, this is going on over here. Noah's out there. But He's in position five, which means he was fifth overall out of, I think, about 30 drivers right now. So he's out there. They're in their warm-up lap, it looks like. Oh my gosh, it is so cold. Is there no way to stay out here the whole race? No. No, we can't stay out here the whole race. There's No. All right, they're lining up now. They're lining up now. He's over there somewhere. He's over there somewhere. See if I can figure out which one he is. He's, oh, I think I see him. I think I see him. He's coming around the first turn. There he's coming around the first turn. There. Oh yeah, I can see the GoPro on his head. That's the cool thing, guys. That's the cool thing. You can go over to his channel and watch the entire race. His channel is Noah Ackerman. That's it, Noah Ackerman. And his little thumbnail is a purple goose. That's how you know. You're in the right channel. All right, this mama's gonna cross fingers and see how it all turns out for him. This is such an exciting day for my boy. Let's see where he goes, Let's see where he is. I think he's still kind of in fifth position right now. All right, there they go. <laughs> This is heat two. He was sixth place in the first race. So this now final race in his division decides who gets to stand on the podium and get a medal. I gotta find him in this pack. Oh, I think that's him. I, I recognize some of his driving style by now. Okay, stay tuned for results. So how do you feel about the day, Noah? It was pretty good. It was pretty good. There's some loud cars around here. <laughs> yeah, there is. You happy with your results? I sure am. And if you want to see how it all went, you got to go check out my channel. I told them that. They got to check out my channel if they want to see where I finished. I already all told them that. I didn't film very much of it. So if they want to see the race, they got to go watch it from your perspective. All right. Head into the store. Get a little work done. Well, it is the day after our big grand opening and I am here to pick out some things for whatnot. I have a, a little help today. Jordan's here, Noah's here, because Noah just had his, his big race day. So uh, 
I'm going to find some stuff. I think we're going to grab some jewelry and some purses this time. So, you know what? I'm not real good with purses. You good with purses? So I'm gonna let Jordan pick out some purses. What what are you good at? What are you good at picking out? No idea. No I no idea. All right. Well we're gonna we have no idea what we're gonna pick out, but we'll show you what's here left in the store after the big day. Hey, let's get shop done. Let's get shop done. Okay. Let's see what's left up in here on our front window. That's kind of cute. I don't think I've ever even noticed that before. I wonder if it has something in it. Let's see. Let's see what's in it. Oh, it's a little jewelry case. That's really awesome. Okay, you know what? Oh, I didn't even get my lucky cart yet. Lucky cart number seven. First item into the lucky cart. I think we still have some of the mugs and stuff too. We'll work our way over there. Easter will be upon us before we know it. Hard to believe, hard to believe. We got one little one little visit by uh, St. Patrick's Day and then we're on to Easter. Oh, I have a lot of work to do around here to get the store fixed back up, process in more stuff to put out on the shelves. Look at these guys, oh my gosh. What are you made of? You're some kind of a little, I don't, it's not, I don't know what that is. It, this looks like clay, but this is almost like that foam, but it's starched like into place. No matter what, it's really super cute with the doggy and the kitty. We'll put that in the cart too. I think they're fighting over candy over there. I hear them in the background. Those are sweet. And remember, as usual, if I don't put something in the cart and you would really like me to run it in the sale, just leave a comment down below. I go through those comments and I'm happy to pull those items. Like maybe a bunny plate. Look at him. Cabbage Bunny by Max Sarah. He's pretty sweet. I think we need to run him. Are you playing Jenga? Did you get, you didn't get to play Jenga yesterday. You were too busy at that cash register, huh? Look at you with your snazzy little race shoes still on. Oh, you're just playing, you're just playing Jenga to play Jenga. All right, let's go over here and see what Crystal's room looks like. Um, as usual, I will be selling a piece of her amazing Pyrex jewelry. It'll be buyer's choice. So take note of that piece that you love because if you're the winner, you can choose. Looks like she sold a couple of her blue ones. And we've got, she says she has pop sockets too. Keychains, money clips, rings. Wow, she sold a lot of stuff in her room yesterday. She's probably uh, pricing things as we speak to restock this tomorrow. I love it. I think that's fantastic. There is still, oh, she sold some of her cadmium jewelry. There's just two pieces left of that. And then some of the uranium jewelry. That is, oh, look at this little girl. How cute is she? That is awesome. I'm so happy she did so well. We sold a bunch of our cookie jars. Not so much the clear glass though. Clear glass, a little tougher to uh, get sold in a retail setting. If you see anything here on the clear glass shelves you would like me to run. You know what, I think somebody asked me to run these last week and I missed it until after the sale. So I will go ahead and put these in my lucky cart this time. Let's get on a clear background here so you can see what we've got. We've got this really beautiful, it's a Mikasa, Mikasa Fine Ivory Shangri-La is the pattern name. And we have salad plates and cups and saucers, dinner plates and bowls. It's a really nice set. Oh, I know. Uh, several of you wanted me to run this last week and 
I wanted to give the local clientele a chance to snag it before I did, but you know what? Jim Shore Snoopy is going in the sale this week. I'm going to snag this. This has been in the case for a while. It's a little coach purse. It's, it's really cute. Did you see this, Jordan? This cute little coach purse? It's cute, isn't it? You're going to pick some purses too, but I'm over here in the case. I'm going to show them the inside. Look at, ah, ah, there we go. There's the coach. We get some very, very nice donations into some of our nonprofits. It's got this a little, like something rested against it or it rested against something there, but this is a nice piece. I've also teased you guys long enough with the fossil. It comes in the tin. And it's a fossil wallet called the Traveler. Huh? What's that? Oh, she's like, huh? What? Huh? Interesting. It is. It's nice. Brand new. Mm. Yes. It's, okay. Uh -huh. It's leather. Are you wearing? Are you wearing Dino Nuggets in your? Yes, I am. You're wearing little dinosaur chicken nuggets. All right. Okay. Oh, remind me. I have a pair of earrings for you at home. <gasps> Wait. <what? laughs> okay. So we're gonna put. Wait, we're going to put What's the, that? wait, 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 gonna, I need to get a I'm shot of it so I can put look. the picture on whatnot. So we're going to put that in the sale uh -huh. and we're going to put that in the sale. I keep forgetting to do this. I'm going to put some of these in the buy now section. These are really, really cute little bulletin boards. So you can put little stick pins in here and there are, are all different um, stamped on pictures here. These will be in the buy now section of the sale. I'm adding my first thing to the car. What? It, oh, the, the little aprons. I can't believe those didn't sell yesterday. Is there just one? Because we had several. I just see one. You just I see like. one? You can see one that you cute. like? Yeah. It is cute. I have a blue one like this. All right. We're going to add that. I'm challenging Danny to take a Jenga piece. Do I need to take a junk piece? Oh my. Oh, oh. Um. Thought you couldn't take from that row. Why not? Because it's too close to the top. No, you can take one from the top. <laughs> All right, well. We're gonna take this one. <laughs> All right. Hey, I gotta get back to shopping. She's gotta get back to shopping. Mom, I, found I just wanted to see this fall. <laughs> she found something. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> I'm gonna put stuff in the car without you seeing. Oh no. Oh no. Well, no, I have to see it because I have to, you know, I have to do a little screenshot for the. I uh, bought this one. Oh, I know. I liked this purse when we got it in. It's a Dooney, isn't it? It looks like it, but I don't think it is. But it it's a, a it's unmarked, so yeah. it's. It's trying to be a Dooney, but it's not marked. Made in El Salvador. Made in El Salvador. Beautiful, though. But this is the whole, like, style of you don't want a mark on your purse. Yeah. That's that's the key of, like, elegance. You don't have a oh. flashy title. So All that's... Right. Well, that's going in the sale. Well, I'm going to let her kind of shop around our new little boutique section. For those who haven't seen, we took the kids' toys out of this section, moved them over. So this is now our boutique clothing shoes boots still priced very nicely oh she found another one what's this one I, oh it's got a little bee on it i donated this one you donated this one <laughs> i bought this one from an antique mall and oh. then donated it to you because i have four like it and i didn't need four well so we sure appreciate that we're gonna sell this one there we go all right i gotta decide now what i want to rearrange these tables with and kind of do a whole little revamping all right you got purses here to shop through. You got purses over there to shop through. We got a lot of purses, so this is a good week to do some purses, for sure. Let's see what we got on the shelves. This sweet little piece is still here. It's got a little transfer of a lady. It's uh, H. Ainsley and Company, made in England. It's got a little crack in the back. I think that's why it's still here. So you know what? Oh, the crack does go all the way through. So I'm going to note that. 
but uh, let's hope we can find it a good home. I start all of my whatnot pieces at $1. So hopefully somebody will want to rescue and give this a good home. Oh my goodness. This is going to be a week for us to really get in donations and get all of the shelves restocked. We had a tremendous, tremendous a grand opening day turnout. I can't even believe the amount of people who were here. If you were one of them, thank you so much. I did not get to say hi to every single person. Uh, and it was just overwhelmingly amazing. I just can't even say it enough. So thank you, thank you, thank you to everyone who is here and helped celebrate this uh, labor of love that has uh, turned into what we now know as the Good Stuff Thrift Store. It's, it's a happening. It's real. And it's only going to grow from here. We've got bigger, bigger things to do all around. Oh, well, he's still here too. This poor little guy. I think I need to find him a new home this time too. Did you find a few? I got some. I got some. Okay, what we got? What so we got? I found this coin purse. And I really like the coin purse. And then I found the matching bag. Oh, so, so we can sell them together as a little that. matching set. Are they a name? I don't know. You didn't even look. I See, know. I love that. I love that it doesn't matter what the name is. It's about how cute is it? No. no yeah. Just no name. But it's it look it reminds me of a Burberry. Yeah. That's, is what it's trying that's to look what like. I think about it. Yeah. Yeah. So all right. There's one. That, that's going in the sale. So we have this brown. I just like brown right now. It's a good quality. It feels soft. I think it's leather. Touch that. Oh, that is nice. Yeah, that's leather. Yeah. And then there's you know the handles. Oh, and it's on. adjustable too. Yeah. The handles are in really good quality. I like handles that are finished edges. That oh, the, I like that too. Yeah. Kind of rolled and finished. Yes. And it's a magnet close. A yeah. oh, it's, magnet. it's got a it's got a name. Divide. Oh, oh, it's a Tignanello. Tignanello. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Me neither. Which is uh, Italian, right? I yeah, don't know. maybe. I don't know, but that's cute. I like it. Oh gosh. Okay. This one, I just like that it opens up super wide. Like oh this. my. Look at this. Deep oh my. Fit, but then it has dividers, so your things aren't going to actually fall ah. out. But you can fit a lot of stuff in here. And for those of you that like to travel, this is a really good travel bag. That is. That's got a name on it, too. Let's see. Jacqueline Smith. She did a line for Target. I don't know. I think she did. But I like her. And it's that, like, cute purple plum color. From Charlie's Angels to Making Purses. Wait, what? Jacqueline Smith was a Charlie's Angel. You did not know this? Wait, let me see that again. <laughs> she's so young. She's so young. Last up, we have this blue bag. I just really like the color of this blue. It's got two pockets. It's a navy. It's a navy blue. Whatever. Blue, you know. It's just it's a navy blue. No name, but it's got two big pockets. I really like sectioning out pockets because you know me. I like being organized with things. So I just like throwing a bunch of stuff in my purse. Yeah, we know, Mom. We know. <laughs> Front clasp closer, messenger bag, hits the hip perfectly. There like we go. It. All right, so we have a nice little uh, array of purses. Somebody asked for this last time and I forgot to put them in the sale last week, so guess what? We're doing the toucan. What is this? This caught my eye yesterday. I'm still like, what is it? Open, open, open. Is it just a little tin, just a little container? What? Why is it? Why does it have a plasticky? Oh, there's tea in here. Oh, it's a tea canister. <laughs> we still have some tea in it. With the, <laughs> been it's really pretty though. It is. It's actually really. It's, it's really pretty. The wallpaper. Yeah, look at that. All right, we'll put that into. All right, let's see which of our mugs are. This is our our name is mud uh, display. We did sell a few things. I know it's so cheesy, right? That's my pick. That's your pick? That's my pick. The, the so cheesy Absolutely. and the sweet dreams are made of brie? Absolutely. Sweet dreams are made of brie. I like the awesome sauce, though, too. I think we will sell this stuff this week. So we're going to sell the uh, the cheese board and spreader or cutter. It's a cutter. The awesome sauce. The uh, some like it hot me so salty and you're so sweet little uh container oh i'm soy into you we'll do that one and i'll love you 
<laughs> That's kind of how Bougie says it. Oh, we also got these really cool, like the, um, they're the absorbent coasters that, what do you call them? You call them, well, they're called Connemar, but there was another name. There's another company, Nature Stone. There, I, there, I knew it was here somewhere. Um, so we've got roosters. We've got like farm animals and it says local, local farmland market on that one. Oop. And then we've got buckets of apples. So we will sell those this week too. We've also got the coffee canister with wooden lid. It's made to look like um, Ray Dunn, but it's not Ray Dunn. They are brand new though. And then we've got the sugar and creamer. It kind of matches, so we'll sell that. And we'll sell that. Do you get this reference? Uh, nope. Billy Madison. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't get it. I don't get it at all. I thought it was going to be from Twilight. Twilight. I don't know. The original rabbit corkscrew. Oh, I just saw the color. I thought the color was nice. It's a rabbit wine opener. Again, if you see something you want me to run, I am so happy to do it. I pick this. You like that? I do. You do. Okay. It's a little uh, mid-century avocado green dish. Jordan says run it. I also really like these. I don't know why. I'm oh, I know. I'm a fan of the, uh, the recipe on the mug. I have the pie dishes, like the pumpkin pie, the apple pie. These are really cute. They are cute. Is, is that one? Why are they lumpy? Oh, it's got a crack handle, too. Darn it. Oh. Yeah, that, they, these are not very good quality ones. They're lumpy. Oh, that's unfortunate. That's weird. That's weird. That's weird. But they are cute. Maybe I could turn them into something else. That's what I'm thinking. Is that a postcard in there? I think it is. It's a little old postcard, very politically incorrect. Very politically incorrect. See, that would have been $1 yesterday because we did that $1 blue tag blowout. I don't know, what do you guys think about that postcard? I Let me know if you want me to run that or anything else you see. Let me know, let me know. What else we got here? We've got more of Annette's little creations. This one has some really pretty crosses in it. That's, uh, uh, is that St. Francis? I think, maybe? I don't know. Does it say it? She makes these. She hand makes these little, little um, traveling altar type things. So perhaps we can put a couple of those in the sale this week. I like these. You like? What are, are they corn holders? Yeah. Oh, red, they white, and blue. They are red, white, and blue. But I like them. Are they melamine? Melamine? I don't know what that means. Mm, plastic? No. They're, oh, no. Oh. Yeah, that, I'm telling they're you. They're ceramic -y. I'm telling you, I like them. We eat corn so much. Well, are you buying them? No, because I already packed my suitcase and I can't fit them. Oh. Oh. Well, I'll save them for the next whatnot sale when you'll have time to attend. How about that? Okay, I like that. Not tomorrow's whatnot sale. What did you do to my store? What do you mean? You did this. I don't know what you're about. Oh, heaven help me. I am gonna have to go through my store and find all these random googly eyes. I don't know what you mean. This is the week. He did not sell. He did not sell during the grand opening celebration. So this is the week we rescue the baby cow. You scared me. You came sneaking up on me. <laughs> what was in the store? I forgot you were here. Would you uh, Would you take this sweet little guy over to the cart? Oh, let's see our little uh, ocean theme section over here and what's left. If you see something that tickles your fancy, let me know. Let me know. Uh oh. Now what did she find? Oh, those are like patterny things. Yeah, old craft books. Oh, I know our craft section is it's big, but it's not as big as it was because we sold a lot of it yesterday. A lot of it. It was a good day. It was a fabulous day. Very excited about how yesterday went. And if you see something that's not in the live sale, feel free to come into the store and buy it. Well, that is true. They can always come into the store and buy it. That looks like majolica. 
That looks like Majolica. But unfortunately, it's got some damage. That's a shame. Yeah, let's see what it says here. Germany, Baden, hand-painted. Such a bummer. And that looks like, it almost looks like Fiesta, but I bet it's like Gibson or something. It's got an N on it. Okay, I don't know who makes those. They're nice quality, though. What a nice, nice color, too. Hmm. Hmm. I don't need them, though. We don't hardly ever eat on plates. <laughs> it's horrible. We're a kind of a paper plate kind of a family. It's just the way we are. We ate steak on plates yesterday. We ate steak on plates yesterday because you cooked, yes. And I'm going to cook more. You're going to cook more. I like, I like hearing that. Here's some of our doggy stuff. I know we sold quite a few food bowls yesterday. We have more of those to replenish with too, which is good. Logical leather, leather dog collar. What are you? Let's see. Oh, it really, it really is a leather dog collar. Look at that. That's actually a really nice leather dog collar. Huh. Huh. I feel like I need to display that a little bit better. There we go. I'm not sure what this is. Oh, <laughs> it's got a, it says it's a hamster accessory. Okay, it's a hamster. It's a little hamster hidey hole thing. That's what it is. So yesterday I was live for many hours and I gave, you know, a tour of the store, but I wanted to show you guys what we ended up doing here because we could not find the Coroplast sheets that we wanted to do like what Goodwill does with their shoes. So uh, one of our volunteers, Brenda, went out and hunted down blue, blue uh, pool noodles. So that got our shoes a little bit raised makes it easier to shop them. Boy, we got we got some straightening up to do. I see that. It is going to be a, a project to put the store back in shape, restock the shelves, but it's going to be a fun project. I'm not complaining. I'm absolutely in the afterglow of all of this and looking forward to doing the work. So I'll show you a little bit of what we have in our jewelry case. If you see something that tickles your fancy, let me know. I'd be happy to run some jewelry this week. I need to bring my ring sizer in because everybody always says, what size is the ring? I need to bring my ring sizer in. Oh, look at that seahorse pin. He's kind of fun. Hello, ma'am. Can I help you with anything? I'm looking at jewelry, sir. Would you like to take a closer look at anything? No, I'm, I'm good. I'm, I'm getting right in there and looking at it. So we're... But thank you. Thank you for being so kind they might want to see something better they can let me know down in the comments so let's go up here on my stage i've got a lot of putting stuff back together this is where we had karaoke the karaoke is all over on facebook i am trying to get my facebook followers up to ten thousand followers which is a really pivotal point for facebook uh, so if you wouldn't mind going over and helping me with that, I would really appreciate it. We have our watch hours over there, but now we need the amount of followers in order to get to a next level of monetization over on Facebook. So if you could help me with that, I would really appreciate it. And all of the karaoke is over there if you want to go watch the karaoke fun that happened yesterday. All right, these are all items that are on my boutique stage that I can run in the sales. If you see something that you want to shout out and say, Danny, would you please run that? I am happy to do so on most things. Like, I'm not really fond of shipping a big lamp. Those I think I'm going to put over um, on eBay and Cherish. That's what I'm going to do with those. But you know what? I've had this item for a very long time. And I, I have a good price on it because it's a hand colored photograph of this mother and these two little girls it's it's the real thing it's got all the information on the back original frame two little girls one holding bouquet of flowers to mother with black dress victorian style the older girl standing by chair seat has girl has long yellow curls i'm reading what i see 
um, blah, 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 Victorian style, blah, 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 blah. So somebody wrote all of this a very, very long time ago. Um, so you know what? I will run this in the sale and I will start it at just $1. I am also going to run this beautiful, I believe it is a Bristol glass. It is a rose bowl. Even though it's not completely round, it's still of that shape. And uh, it's like a Victorian piece as well. So we'll run that in the sale. Oh yes, I have some work to do and I have so much more I want to stock my stage with. So that is going to happen this week finally since I can concentrate a little bit on such things. Yes, indeed. This is what I have over here. Our Christmas section got pretty wiped out. We still have some amazing stuff, but we're going to have to restock that for a Christmas in July sale in a couple of months. Oh, I love when she shops the... Uh, collectible stuff. You like that? The I little hand-painted shell dish? I like the flowers. Does it have a name? Harrison. <laughs> Where do you see hair? Are you just giving it? <laughs> just giving... I was close. I was <laughs> close. Helen. Helen painted this in 1963. All right. I can put that in the sale too. All right. I will probably do a dedicated sale up here one week once I get myself kind of reorganized. I want to cut down all this stuff in the, it's an empty bottle of wine, dear. It's an empty bottle. I want to cut this down because I have so many fabulous pieces of clothing that I want to put some clothing racks up here in my area as well. And yeah, so, uh, boy, there's so much work to do. All right, Jordan, if you would help me get these items okay. over to the cart, I would be so appreciative. All right, let's see how Mikey and Sonny's room is doing. I do believe they're doing a whatnot sale after mine tomorrow. I do believe they will throw some of these awesome goodies. And oh, hello. Somebody gave Doreen googly eyes. Oh my goodness. No, that's a horrible look for Doreen. I could have been anybody. No, that's a horrible look for Doreen. Okay. <laughs> Ooh. I bet they're going to run this, maybe the fishy. I think they're going to run some of these really cool things. Oh, look at these little salt and peppers and piggy salt and peppers. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And if you let me know in the comments something you want them to run, I can convey that over because I will be here. They do get some really cool stuff. They do get some cool stuff. Fantastic. Oh, Noah found the cart. I left it by the front of the store. I left it by the front? Why did I take it up to the front? I must have been picking something up. All right. No worries. Oh, look at this mug with the little, the little ball they're playing with. That's so cute. All right. Let's go see what Carrie did in her room. Do we just have saws on display? Do we have saws on display? If you see a saw, we have saws. All right. Those look like little Wade figurines. So Carrie is away again this week. Um, she's doing another trade show. And I think when she gets back from that, she's around for a while. And we're going to get her doing her own whatnot sales. I'm going to get her doing it because she has some amazing things that I know you guys want to buy. This is the, uh, the uh, I call it, I call it lovingly uh, Pocahontas Elvis velvet painting that we got at the bins. The bins, that was at the bins. I can't believe that was at the bins. We've got her little clothing rack in here. Little shelf of goodness over here. And of course, Carrie's always willing to sell things just straight through, just email me. If you see something that you wanna buy of Carrie's, she'll take care of you. Let's go over here to Pick a Road Boutique, who now, in case you didn't know, have launched their own YouTube channel. So now you can see them find the fabulous stuff that they do, along with watching them shop with me, because we do go out and shop together. We have great fun doing that. And um, 
here's their little room. Now, they are also doing a whatnot sale tomorrow after mine. So we will probably uh, do a little raid action tomorrow. In fact, I'm quite sure that's going to happen. And the fabulous Tiffany of Thrifting Vegas, she did a whatnot sale yesterday. So just got to go over and follow her on whatnot and find out when she's going to schedule something else. She stocked a whole bunch of... Really? Really? <laughs> she stocked a whole bunch of new stuff into her room. Oh, look at those bunnies. Those bunnies are really cute. Uh, I still, I really like, I'm always drawn to this piece in her room. I would use this as a stand for one of my crystal spheres. I would just place it right there in the center. I wouldn't use it as a flower frog which is what its original purpose was i would i would literally put like a big beautiful crystal on there that may that may end up coming home with me it might it might all right and there's tiffany's all right i'm gonna load all my stuff onto my special shelf over here these items are already over in my whatnot catalog for you to leave pre-bids if you can't get to the sale itself Oh my goodness, what am I seeing right now? I'm out, I'm out. <laughs> I'm glad he can entertain himself. <laughs> we need to get out of here. Oh, yes we do. All right, so we're going to load the special show. Oh, what'd you find? I want to buy these. She wants to buy those. All right, after I check her out, uh, we'll load the shelf. All those items will be over in my whatnot sale by the time this video comes out. So bookmark the sale, check it out. The first comment of this video will have a link. If you've not already signed up for Whatnot, you can get $15 to spend over on Whatnot. And there will be a link to the actual sale where I will be selling all of these things. So come on over, join us at 3 p.m. Pacific time on Monday. And uh, with that, you go be profitable and make it fun. I love that he says it. Make it fun.